Hey there, Lynn Allen here. Welcome to another AutoCAD tip courtesy of Catalyst Magazine. Hope everything's going great so far for you this week. I'm gonna continue on my quest to save you money on painkillers. You know, Advil, aspirin, Tylenol, pick your painkiller of choice, I don't know, alcohol. <laughs> so we're gonna continue, we're gonna wrap it up on external references and the dreaded broken links. Now, if I were to take a look at this external reference manager, it looks like everything's okay, right? I don't have any broken links right now. I don't have any of the dreaded exclamation points telling me that things are, we have issues. Um, however, if I look more closely, I can see that I still have some hard-coded paths, some absolute paths, and that makes me a little bit nervous because if somebody starts remapping drives or moving files around, well, then I'm gonna get the dreaded exclamation points and I'm gonna have the awful broken, broken links, I'm gonna need the painkillers, people are gonna start drinking in the office, it's gonna go badly, I don't want that to happen. So what I would probably do is I would probably select these files with the absolute pass, like this guy here. I'd hold my control key down and pick that one here. I mean, any others that were absolute. And I would change the path type to relative. Right now, one nice feature inside of AutoCAD 2018 is that uh, absolute, in this case, in the past, was not grayed out. It wasn't clear what these were currently set to. Should have been, should have, grayed out make absolute because I can't really pick that, but it didn't, which was confusing. So now it is. It's a simple little change, but it does make a big difference. So I could click on make relative. Um, I could also click on remove path and create complete havoc in the office. <laughs> Drive the CAD manager crazy. Do that right before you're about to leave your job. Don't do that if you intend on sticking around. So I'm gonna switch it to make relative. Now watch the external reference manager. You can see, of course, those hard-coded C colon backslash yada yada went away. And now things potentially wouldn't go as bad if drives get remapped or files get moved around. Yay, that's a good thing, right? Avoided more of the dreaded exclamation points, which I like. And uh, save, once again, money on painkillers. Always a good goal. Okay, but the real feature that I wanna show you today that was added into AutoCAD 2018, wait till you see this, happens when you go into the save as command, which when it comes to external references, usually leads to bad things occurring. Am I right? You know what I'm talking about. I'm gonna go into save as, I'm gonna save this file to a different directory, which if you have those absolute paths, usually, causes bad, bad, bad things to happen. So I'm gonna save it to a totally different directory. You can see I'm gonna go up to a completely, well, one more extra directory, and let's call this, I've got a Fred in that directory. Let's have some equal rights here. We'll call it Wilma. I'm gonna do a save. Oh my gosh, look at this dialog box. I love this dialog box. I'm going to print this dialog box. I'm gonna frame it. I'm gonna put it on my living room wall it's such an awesome dialog box wow Ooh, check this out the current drawing was saved to a different location do you want to update references with relative pass oh my gosh this is so beautiful i'm gonna cry this is fantastic and you'll see on there update relative paths recommended oh my gosh you should say pick me pick me pick me pick me hopefully you have intelligent people in your office who will take the recommended pass and they won't pick the dreaded don't update pass. It has, should have a big skull and crossbones right next to that. Don't pick me, don't pick me, don't pick me. <laughs> now if I were a CAD manager, I would click on that always perform my current choice and then I would go in there one time on everybody's system and I would click on update relative pass so that nobody had to worry about this in the, in the future. It would just default to that because that's the way it should always be. That's the way God intended it to be, <laughs> I'm quite sure. Anyway, so of course, I'm gonna click on update relative pass. Oh, it's so beautiful. I think I feel a tear coming on. It's fabulous. And now, from this point forward, I wouldn't have to worry about those dreaded broken links. Once again, saved all that money on Tylenol, my, my painkiller of choice. Once again, you can pick whatever you want. Everything is gonna be so much more beautiful in the office, like namaste, am I right? <laughs> It's going to be peaceful. It's going to be fantastic. All right, so that wraps it up for all of the features inside of AutoCAD 2018 that are going to make the world of external references so much more beautiful, so much more peaceful. So I'm going to see you back here in two more weeks. Oh, yeah. Namaste.